Hello, my name is Khalil, and today we're going to do an application about real-time visualization using MQTT. So first of all, you need to create category and things. In my example, I have properties as temperature. And next, you need to create real-time visualization workbooks and just create a new workbook. I'm going to call it graph to create and we'll add a new table you can edit the name add a description and we'll choose in this streaming mqtt so for the broker url you can go to the documentation and you'll find in the mqtt here in the server you can find your local host which is just need to copy and paste and in the documentation you have all the topics that you can use i'm gonna use the first one where you can access to the data and use it as a publisher or a subscriber but for the topic i'm gonna copy it from here and add here and we'll just add data and we we'll remove the first class for the user id i'm gonna come back to the things page anything db interfaces this is my username and i need also to generate a password so auto generate on save and i need to copy the password uh, i need to copy the username paste it here and copy the password also paste it here in order to generate columns you need to have a data flow so i'm receiving the data right now so I should have the temperature because I'm receiving the data temperature right now. Just wait a bit. And here is my data. So I'm going to go down to the time ID columns. I'm going to give it a thematic time ID. And we'll go to transform settings and activate the series analysis and save. In start preview, we can see our data here. And just I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna select the area where I want my graph and go down to time series and select line. Gonna drag and drop temperature to the Y. And we'll start receiving my data. For a better data visualization, you can add a title or text by uh, going to general select text label and I will add them as title and you can adjust the color and the size and also you can add image or a logo by going to general and image box choose file and we'll select this image also another useful thing that you can add a map where you can localize your sensors by adding the longitude and latitude we need to save the dashboard and if we want we can pause the real-time visualization also we can create a pdf report clicking here and selecting like including all the dashboard or selecting the current dashboard or we can select the dashboard we have actually have only one dashboard we click OK and save and raise the PDF file we have and that's how you can create graphs and reports using real-time visualization.